Hello, sweet souls. Happy Thursday, September 7th. Happy birthday to the Virgos. Uh, we're going to call in St. Michael. St. Michael, please return to sender. Anyone sending a will through thought, word, or action toward myself at the viewer. We're going to call in the Holy Spirit, angel, saints, spirit guides, and the ancestors and ask for a message for your greater good. I am doing the 20% special on my 20 and 40 minute readings. Text or email to schedule that. I'm also discounting my deck to 3555 if you're interested in purchasing that. Um, send an email to my husband at tashas.merch at gmail.com, all lowercase, no apostrophe. Um, also, if you're interested in purchasing a bracelet, you can send an email to the same location. Okay, so let's see. What does the collective need to know? Is that great? Okay, please. Okay, so the first card out is chop wood, and <laughs> what I heard when this card came out was to literally clear out the clutter. Some of you, you're being inspired to spring clean, like get rid of things. Um, so on an energetic level, the reason they were asking you to do this is because you're creating space uh, for new things to come in. So putting in the work, whether it's cleaning your house, purging things, getting rid of things, uh, or releasing bigger things, people, places, or things that aren't in alignment with you. It's putting you in this energy of receiving with poised here. And you may have an inner knowing, you may have a feeling that your soulmate is headed your way because your soulmate is in your energy. So you've healed from abandonment and rejection with the orphan card and you embrace peace after closing a very karmic cycle. And now things are aligning for you. It's bringing in a lot of happiness. This is God creating a new balance, uh, stability in your life, card number four. Uh, so that's awesome. All right. Let's clarify these cards. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel, Saints, Spirit Guides, and Ancestors. Please clarify. Chop wood. Yeah, so you have the strength and courage to walk away from situations that aren't in alignment, to clear the clutter, okay? You have blocked communication from someone that gave very little to you in the past. This is someone that created a lot of stress and anxiety that wants to rush in, but you have put an end to that with Chop the Wood. You've put in the work to release yourself from something that no longer serves you, and you've done the healing work, so that's awesome. Okay, please clarify, poised, poised, being in this high vibration, open to receive. With poised, you are making plans for some of you are calling in a king of cups. This is someone that's loving, kind, and empathetic. This is someone that will give to you emotionally. This is someone that's very intuitive as well. This is part of your good karma because you had the strength and courage to take your power back. Um, to run the show, to be the leader in your own life and not allow other people to come in and manipulate you. So this is a reward and a blessing from God, okay? Please clarify deep knowing. Deep knowing. Yeah. So you had inner knowing that whoever it was that you had to move away from in the past would receive a tower. You knew this, but you just kept pushing forward, embracing your new life. This was a very greedy masculine energy that could have been a father of your children. This is someone that is very controlling and dominating. This is someone that withheld from you, not only energetically, physically, spiritually, but financially. Um, this is someone that deeply wounded you, but this is someone that was in a an illusion and you may have known this you may have sensed that this person was going down the wrong path and their delusions was going to lead them to being trapped and that's exactly what happened okay so please clarify soulmates please clarify soulmates
So you're calling in a new soulmate, and then you have this fiery energy that operates. They project that they're in the King of Wands upright, but they're actually um, a Knight of Wands, a player energy that operates from lust. They see you as this pre empress that you're grounded and stable you're financially secure you have abundant energy this is a karmic to you and you've closed the cycle out so this is someone that's still attached to your energy and they know that you are calling in a soulmate or that you already have a soulmate in your life and this is someone that's still trying to hold on to your energy please clarify orphan With orphan, you healed from the bam and rejection and your past person did not. Instead of healing, they came after you with a vengeance trying to take you down, but this was a very bad investment on their part. They're feeling very foolish because the truth is coming to light and this is someone from your past. Wow. And it was a past soulmate. This was a karmic soulmate that you had that put 10 swords in your back. Now they're stuck in heavy regret and heartbroken for their own actions. Wow, okay. So, they do spy on you, wanting to send a message because now they see you as the star to the Queen of Pentacles. They spy on you working, speaking your truth. This person has become obsessed with your energy. Okay, so let's clarify chop wood. With chop wood we see that you had the strength and courage to block someone from the past that didn't have anything to offer you. They only created stress and anxiety in your life. They want to rush in, but you've put death to the situation. Let's clarify chop wood. Yeah. Create fortune in reverse and imprisonment. This person from your past went to a new situation because they thought they were going to get great fortune and they didn't get what they thought. Now they're trapped in that situation. This keeps coming out, like literally keeps coming out. So with poise, we see that you're making plans for the future. You could be calling in this king of cups, someone that's loving, kind, and empathetic, very intuitive, someone that will give emotionally to you. This is your good karma because you took your power back. You run your life. You are in control. So poised. Clarify poised. main male and gift you're calling in a new masculine that will view you as the gift someone that they would honor and treasure cherish okay deep knowing you had inner knowing you knew that the tower would come for whoever hurt you you knew that and you moved away you embraced your new beginning and this masculine that could be a father figure very controlling and dominating that withheld from you physically spiritually emotionally financially they deeply wounded you, but they created illusion. And being in this delusional state of mind, they trapped themselves. And you knew that this was going to happen. You had inner knowledge, okay? Keep knowing. Yeah, this person wanted you to be in poverty, but it's reversed. It didn't work. You are the official person. You have a stable home, a happy home life. You're being blessed. With soulmate, we see somebody from your past that's still trying to attach to your energy because either they know a soulmate's coming in or you're already with someone. This is someone that pretends to be a masculine that leads with honor, but this is a player energy that they only operate from ego and lust, okay? They see you as this abundant lady of luxury, proud, confident, and dependent. This was a karmic to you and you closed the cycle because you're calling in a new soulmate. Please clarify soulmate. Yeah. This person is, is holding on to your energy because they chose the karmic and now they're under judgment. We got lovers, judication, and false person. This person is waking up to the fact that they threw away a soulmate for a false person and now they're under judgment. Things may be falling apart in this person's life and they're starting to understand why. With Orphan, we see someone from your past that, that wanted to win at all costs. They wanted to destroy you, but they made a bad investment. They feel foolish because truth is coming to light. This was someone from your past. 
you were connected to them on a soul level and they put 10 swords in your back. Now this person is stuck in regret and in heartbreak because of their own actions. They do watch you. Please clarify it, Orphan. There is change occurring in regards to your new beginning. There is change. You see, this person tried to take you down. Mature woman and occupation in reverse. They tried to destroy your occupation and how you made money. They tried to destroy your image. This is defamation of character. They stalked you. They, they had fake accounts. They did all kinds of things if you had an online business to try to destroy you, okay? Or if you don't have an online business, they did anything they could to try to interfere with your job. And you are high honor. Yeah. You have sudden wealth and you have a new courtship coming in. You could also be receiving a message. What is this message? This message is about someone trying to block your pathway, but you have unexpected income. And it's in the upright. Yeah, it's someone from your past. Because what they did, they didn't expect it would turn out the way that it has, but this is a masculine from your past that fell from grace. So be weary of anybody that tries to message from the past. This looks like um, they're just trying to cause a problem for you. So Spirit wants you just to keep moving forward. Don't worry about what they're doing. That's between them and God. Continue to pray. You know, be in a space of love because that's, that's what God expects of us. To be in loving energy regardless of who went against us. That's between them and God. They will be accountable. So just be in love energy. Continue to pray for them and for yourself, for others. And just know that you will you will get what's due to you. You will get what's fair. And so will they. So just continue focusing on being on, in a high vibration, okay? I'm going to do the Cancerian Oracle real quick. Truth and only truth for the collective. What does the collective need to know? one step at a time some days are harder than others guys you just have to trust abundance is headed your way this is a money increase stability wealth you are gifted they want you to trust your gut you're guided and you are protected for some of you could be traveling there is a shift happening fast results you're breaking the cycle and it's okay to change direction no to anyone from the past they said reconsider for your best you went through an awakening and these people in the past no longer align to you you are on the right path keep pushing forward set boundaries protect your energy and say no because you're being led on your destined path it's meant to be have faith and believe there's a new opportunity coming this could be shocking to you, something that you don't expect with the tower here, but it's a blessing. They just need you to be patient. Take your time, ask for help. More information is coming. Yeah, good news is coming. Hard times are over. New opportunity. Just be patient. That's awesome. The bottom of the deck says fall back. No need to worry. Take a break. Everything's going to work out. You can't miss this opportunity. It's coming in when it's meant to. So just be in your high vibration and relax, okay? All right, guys, this is the reading I have for you. I love you. I hope that you have an amazing day. Bye-bye.